We start in Byron. The Tigers and Genoa Kingston began the night tied for first place in the Big Northern Conference, along with Dixon. All of them were 3-0. and Yeah, that log jam would be broken up. The Cogs took on the Tigers in our game of the week. Anytime these big games go down at Everett Stein Stadium, the fans packed the stands, and tonight was no different. This is a defensive battle the whole way. It was 7 0 at the half to start. So the third quarter, Braden Smith passes over the middle. That's picked off by Nolan Perry. One of the few passes the Tigers had tonight, and Perry's got some running room. He's going to take it all the way back, but look, he hears over the loudspeaker there's a flag, and it's coming back. The interception would stand, though, so it's still Cog's ball. You know, Kingston nabbed their first points of the game on a Ben Yunker field goal, so it's 7 3. Byron's still in the lead. Go right to the end now. Jeff Boyer trying to milk the clock. It's third and long. Need a first down to keep the drive going. Smith takes the snap. Fires towards the sideline and finds Ethan Paul's kill right into the bread basket. That's a first down. Cheerleaders are loving this tight finish. Same drive, second and long. This time Smith keeps it. What a heads up play here. Slides and stays in bounds and keeps the clock going. That would do it from there as the Tigers run it out. Byron remains perfect. They improved to 4-0 with a 7-3 win. Boyer said afterwards, he had a feeling this one could have been a slugfest. We knew they were really good on defense, and, and we feel pretty good on defense. There's, uh, there's obviously some things we got to work on offensively, but uh, we'll get better. We've gotten better since week one, and uh, we'll continue to improve. I think we just kept believing in each other. I mean, we knew they were going to throw everything they had at us, but at the end of the day, we just believed in each other, and kept stuck to our game plan and that came up with the win for us. You now this gives us a ton of confidence going in next week to a good North Boone team. Great team. We're going to have to play just as well as this, if not better, to, to beat them. They're a great team, but this gives us a big boost of confidence.